Back to football. Dino Nlovu is reportedly one of the highest paid South African players in the world. After deciding to ply his trade abroad and forge a career out of his comfort zone. Now the Zhejiang Greentown striker in China's League One is urging other players from his country to follow in his footsteps and expand their horizons. CGTN Thias Duplessis has more. 2020 has been an incredibly tough year for everyone. You've been literally in the epicenter of where they first detected COVID. How difficult was it being a player based overseas uh, with everything that was going on? 40% of our, my team is there from Wuhan. I could, you know, feel and see the outrage, the, the, the pain they have in their eyes when, you know, we were in Thailand or in Turkey talking about being away from their families. For those past two months when we held up uh, our preseason for the upcoming uh, last season. How have you been welcomed in China? I mean, you've been there a while now and, and you've, you've been their leading goal scorer for some time. You've come agonizingly close to promotion to the Super League. But how have you as, as a foreign national, I know there's another Zimbabwean player and a Brazilian in, in, this, in the squad too, but what's it been like? For me, I think the first year, it, it was one of the years that I thought, you know, going to China, I don't know much about the country, I don't know, I don't know much about the culture, the league, I thought it was going to be a, 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 a walk in the park. But you find that when you get to that country, you see that how ignorant we are as a football world, whether it's Europe, whether it's Africa, we always think that in Asia there's no football. But you tend to see that there's a lot of talent but as I think for me personally, the welcome has been tremendous, you know. I've, they've welcomed me, in, you know, in warm hands and uh, they've, you know, treated me as one of their own. Could you see more South Africans and, and, and fellow African players ending up in China? I know the Super League is, is very attractive financially. Could you see more African and South African players heading that way? Slowly but surely, I'll open, the doors will be open for more and more South African players to, you know, leave their comfort zone and, you know, go challenge themselves. Not only the talent, but also themselves, their character and, and, and their personality in the Chinese Football League.